Oh, welcome back to Tavoli's. What's up? Um, yeah, fucking Tim Schafer, like Mr. Shitface, is an anagram for Tim Schafer. <laughs> it's pretty good. Tim Schafer. Oh. Yeah, you take all the letters of Tim Schafer, you could spell Mr. Shitface. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure he got really mad about that too. <laughs> Who thought of that? I don't know. I don't know. It's just funny though. I love it. <laughs> Tim <laughs> Schaefer is an anchor for Mr. Shitface. Yeah. Coincidence? I think not, especially with that recent debacle. <laughs> what recent debacle? Double Fine are basically lovable rogues who can sell exciting promises with the best of them. They're apparently bad at managing large amounts of Kickstarter money and game development schedules. Oh, that would make sense. That happens with a lot of companies, I think. Alright, I don't really want to get any more gear, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna go somewhere else. <laughs> Alright, I gotta put some stuff away, and I gotta get some more potions, because I am almost dead. The first thing that comes up is Oni talks about an actor with a hilarious anagram for his name. Yeah, Mr. Shitface. Yeah, I was telling you. <laughs> Ever since I heard that, like, that's the only thing I can think of. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Fucking Shitface. Mr. Shitface. This is an anagram name. <laughs> it's pretty good, dude. It's pretty good. What the fuck has Tim Schafer even been up to lately? I think he was working on Psychonauts 2. Really? Yeah. I don't think I ever beat that game. Psychonauts was interesting. It was fun. Yeah, it was a cool game. Hard. Good. Hard at the end, at least. A lot of platforming. You know, 3D fl platformers are not always the best. But I liked I liked how, <laughs> like, when you would do a double jump in that game, he would make, like, a little, like, psionic orb come out from that. Yeah, and then you jump on that. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Yeah, that's a lot better than, like... They've released that game, like, several times, though. Like, you can get it, I think, on PS4, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lot better than uh, most games where you just double jump in midair, because that's how that works. Yeah? You just push the air. Where's my Celebrious Brew? Do I not have any more of those? Oh, well. Whatever. This game's a clusterfuck. <laughs> I don't know, my name is Pablo. Uh, no, that's Ass Salami. <laughs> ass. Oh, I forgot to start that. Whoopsie. We're off by two and a half minutes. Okay. Shit. So where, where are we now? Main city? Yeah. We're in main city, and I'm going to go talk to the princess because she wanted me to go visit her tower or something like that at nighttime. Touch your bobs. The, the problem is I'm not supposed to be in there at nighttime, so if I get caught, I get thrown out. Uh, or I, get, I think I get thrown in the jail. So Look at this popping. I know. <laughs> well, that's PS3 for you. So I'm going to save it right here. Actually, I should probably save it when it, as soon as I get inside. So you're gonna touch your bobs? What are those? It's, what it's, are those? It's your bobs. What? You know, bobs. Or boobles? Yeah, no, no, they're called bobs. Bobs? Bob. Like her hairdo? No, like tits. Oh. <laughs> it's a thing that uh. Indian men tend to do to uh, women uh -huh. is uh, let me see your bobs because they don't figure Whoa, out. man. They don't apparently put uh, a second O in boobs, so they just keep saying bobs. That's funny. In in vagina. Vaginas. Yeah, vagina. Wow, these guys have got some astigmatism or something. Yeah. <laughs> Question mark. Does he have a quest? Yeah, he's got like a quest for me or something. His quest is to set you into the dungeon if you get caught. Oh, oh, which way are you going? Oh, you shit! You shit, shit like You shit bird! You shit cock! Fucking ladybird! That reminds me, I actually did deliver a box of live ladybugs the other day. Oh, how'd that go? It was fine. I mean, they just had a little box with some holes in it. Yeah, it smell like ladybugs. Uh, maybe like the tiniest bit, yeah. Ladybugs smell like fucking garbage. Yeah. Like if you crush them, they fucking stink. 
They're little little beats. You're not supposed to be there. Yes, sir. Am I supposed to meet her in the tower or in the garden? I forget. Are you supposed to meet her in the garden? Probably garden. Oh, castle gardens. Yep. Just jump off into the garden. No, I'll die. I should have known that. Bam. Well, you are supposed to meet her up in like the tower at one point too, where her husband tries to strangle her. Oh, that's. Is it consensual? Uh, it doesn't look like it. That's what it always looks like. I like how stealth in this game is so bad that it's just like I'm just running and like nobody gives a shit. Yeah, it's because you're you're running on carpet. Nobody can hear you. That's how it works in stealth games. Once you're on the concrete, that's when everyone's like clack 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 clack. Like <laughs> you put <laughs> if it was a like you fucking put clogs on. If it was a oh, I to talk to this bitch and then she's gonna be like, go to the tower. <laughs> Oh my god. You gotta go to the tower. Hey, make sure that no one's being strangled up there. Yeah, I got see now I gotta go up there. God damn it. So I already did this shit. I don't know what that is, but I'll take it. Angel's pipe pet. Pipe pet tar right there. It's a it's a it's a pipe pet. It's a pipe pet? Yeah, it's a pipe pet. You know. Uh, the the things that uh like an eyedropper? Yeah. Pipe pet. An eyedropper is an actual item in this game. Where are you going, dude? <laughs> what was oh. that? Why are the doors all side open? Oh, well, whatever. I'm pretty sure I saw someone running out. <laughs> hmm. They have such bad reaction times with bad eyesight, it doesn't really matter. So does it, like, uh, uh, do it like a text box or something if uh, you get caught? Maybe, I don't remember. Or can you just fucking book it? <laughs> No, I think it's a text box, and they're like, "You're not supposed to be here." <laughs> oh, oh. See, that like it's just that easy though to get there. Like, look at you go up here, and then that guard won't be there now. See, he's gone. Ah, it's probably because the king was up in there. I just fucking spoiled what happens in this street. <laughs> <laughs> Duchesses. Oh, uh, I don't uh, see any strangle. Oh, uh, well, not yet. Why? Why am I your warrior? I'm gonna touch your bobs. I don't even know you. You must be ashamed of this. You are. <laughs> yes, you <laughs> are. Turning, turning your tits like knobs? Is that what you're yeah. doing? Yeah, that's what you do with tits. Have you, ne have you never felt tits before? Because it's definitely just... Yeah. It's like an Indian burn. <laughs> but for a But you're dialing in the frequency. Yeah, you gotta I really... I can't no! <laughs> when she starts screaming, that's when I know. <laughs> Alright, what's with the, the fucking gesture? He was there before. Yeah, but why? Why I don't is he? Know. Just to be weird. I'm gonna jack off. That character is so interesting because it's like nobody in this game has like any personality, but he's got like sinister intentions. It feels like every single time that you see him. Yeah, but you only see him like twice in the game. You don't have to dress up for your fucking husband. Why are you backing away from him? Because he's walking into a bubble. Your hair is like paper. It's glued onto your head. I'm gonna touch your. <laughs> oh my god! Is this their kink? Is that where you stop them or not? I know. Well, if you're sorry, then why don't you stop? I don't know if this ever, like, is explained. Ooh, what did they got back here? <laughs> oh, sweet, got Lee's corset. What up, dude? Dude, you should probably, like, stop. That's sweet how my shield is not on my back in the cutscene. It's pretty sweet. That's the one thing, like, in Monster Hunter, like, I use the charge blade in that game, and, like, when you have it on your back, it's just a gigantic shield on your back. So you can't even see your character, like, at all. It's good. 
I've been playing that game a lot lately, and I've been getting some of the layered armor, which is like uh, armor that just changes your appearance, but it doesn't affect your stats. So if you want to look a certain way. I finally got Dante's gear. They have a Witcher mission in the game, too. Ooh. You play as uh, fucking Gerald, and you go around and you fight a, a Leshen or whatever. That's one of their monsters, right? A Leshen? Leshen? Yeah. Yeah. You fight one. It's pretty cool. It's it's funny, too, because, like, in the game, you go, like, like, in that mission, the Monster Hunter one, you go around and you, like, investigate clues and shit, and it's got, like, dialogue options that show up just, like, in The Witcher 3. It's kind of funny. Oh! So now she's framing me for, for everything, so they're like, we're gonna take you to prison or whatever. And then Those are some fucking paddle ass swords. I know. I think I get beaten or something like that, too. It's hot. And then she tells me I can escape. Yeah, yeah just there's a, a dagger knobs in. <laughs> I was there to listen to the radio. <laughs> the teaser nips. I'm here to see her titties. <laughs> yeah, fucking the Duchess is a goddamn lesbian. Oh, she disappeared. <laughs> yeah, it's like a metronome, dude. Like, it was so consistent. Yeah, he was just... <laughs> okay, God, no! He's going to be a good musician. Yeah, yeah. He's, He'll be a really great he's, drummer later. He's, he, he's the dude that eventually... <laughs> he's like, he hops do that again. He whips somebody too hard one day and kills them, and then, like, the fucking, as punishment, the king... Uh, or the dude cobbles him and his fucking legs are broken. But then he gets a wheelchair. <laughs> and he learns how to drum. And then he becomes the three eyed raven. <laughs> just just mix everything in there. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Well, <laughs> right. <laughs> For no he reason. becomes the king then. <laughs> yeah, well, it reminds me of that one Dave Chappelle sketch where he's like taking revenge on all these people that fucked his life over, and there's that one dude in the wheelchair. <laughs> and then he throws him down the stairs. I have not seen that. <laughs> I'm sure you have, but he's like. Like, I think he, he was like. <laughs> he. Dave Chappelle's waiting for the dude to arrive, like he was gonna like set the house, like the building on fire. He pours gasoline all over the place, and then he comes in in a wheelchair. He's like, "Oh my god, I had no idea that your life was so bad, man. Can you just smell that gas? I was gonna kill you in here." <laughs> and, then, and then he's like, "I forgive you, man. It's okay." And then he's like, "Thank you, thank you so much for making this all that much sweeter, you motherfucker." And then he takes him to the stairs, and then he's like, oh, "What the fuck, man?" What are you doing, man? <laughs> and he throws his ass down the steps. I'm gonna look this up. It's so funny. <laughs> I think this is like the only time I'm like unarmed in the entire game. How come the rat gives me more experience on the fucking spider? Oh, gets revenge. Yeah. It's like a two minute long thing that I'll yeah. watch. <laughs> I was gonna put. The... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I want like a. A good... This is, like, off of someone's fucking TV. That's most of the Chappelle stuff is off of people's TVs. It's kind of stupid. I remember the fucking being DVDs and shit of that back in the day. Oh, okay. And then he, like... <laughs> walks outside of the burning building. Like he obviously sets the building on fire, too, with the guy in it still, and then he walks outside, and there's a lady running by with a baby in her arms, and he comes out laughing, and he's just like, oh, I just want to hold him. I just want to hold him. He takes the baby out of her arms and just fucking drop kicks it. <laughs> he's just, oh! It's so fucking stupid. <laughs> I've been watching a lot more Chappelle show lately. Like, at the gym, when we're running, it will just be on. Really, like I, I put I'll be put I'll put Comedy Central on. That's a good show. And I'll just be like, it's, good it's, show. it's either Chappelle show, BoJack Horseman, or hmm. South Park. That's weird. 
Like, one of those three are on, so I just fucking watch it. You, you know what's great? The best part about this is this whole quest I just did has no bearing on anything. Like, the, I just broke out of prison, but nobody gives a shit. No. Like, I'm not... I Like, if the authorities see me, they don't care. <laughs> and I already have all my gear again. It's like, alright, cool. That was a dumb quest, wasn't it? Yeah, that was literally just, like, a waste of time. I know, but I got XP, and I did... I got a ladies corset out of it, so that's worth it, right? Woo! You're gonna be toy like a toyga. It's, I don't know. It's a quest to do. At least it's something different. <laughs> Instead of me just running around getting killed all the time. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, next time on Chin Strap Chaps, we actually do something of, of note in this game. <laughs> Instead of just watching a woman get strangled. Not 